Welcome to East Coast LQ Reviews today. I'm reviewing another beer by Heavy Seas. This is Double Cannon, Double IPA. And I got Beer Advocate pulled up here. So Beer Advocate score is uh, 87 for very good. Style is an American Imperial IPA. ABV or alcohol by volume is 9.5%. It's uh, by Heavy Seas Beer out of Maryland, United States. Uh, availability is uh, year-round. And on the side of the bottle, it says uh, the bold and brash daredevil massively dry hopped this irresistible force showcases the power of bringing in the extra artillery 9.5 percent alcohol by volume um so i'm gonna crack it open pour it into my dual go over the color with you guys So, uh, color of the beer, it's a nice uh, amber color. Um, I kind of poured it kind of slow, so it didn't really produce much of a head. So, uh, white head to it. Um, yeah, like an amber color, like a hazy amber, kind of orange. Um, it's got some clarity to it, but it is uh, pretty hazy. Um, so, let's go for the nose. On the nose, I'm getting a lot of, uh, a lot of citrus, a lot of that, like, piney hop resin. It's nice and sweet, too, so it's got, a, um, some caramel malt. It's got some tropical flavor to it as well. So, like, some pineapple. Also, a little bit of grapefruit. Um, but it smells pretty good. Let's go for the taste on this one. Lots of hops on the finish with this one. Very nice, decent bitterness. Um, with this double IPA, I'm getting a lot more of the hops. Um, so that finish lingers for a good amount of time. Lots of caramel malt. Uh, breadiness. Up front, I do get a lot of, like, the citrus, so I'm getting kind of, like, that fruity, lemony taste, along with some, uh, grapefruit. Pineapple on the taste as well. Um, lots of caramel malt, like I said. So, for this double IPA, you definitely get a lot more of the hops than you do get the fruity or tropical flavors. Um... Mouthfeel's about medium. Carbonation's about medium to high. It's got some good carbonation to it. Cyclops scale. It is pretty sweet. And it does have a good bitterness to it on the finish. So for the Cyclops scale, I'm going to say like 3 out of 5 sugar cubes. And like 4 out of 5 hop cones. So if you're a hop head and you really like hoppy beers, I would definitely check this one out. So for a rating, in my opinion, I actually, I kind of wish it had a little bit more of the fruity tropical flavor to it. Um, it does have a good amount, but like I said, I'm just getting a lot more of the hops and the caramel malt rather than the uh, tropical fruity flavor. Um, so I'm going to give this one a, it is a really good beer. Um, I think I would pick other double IPAs over this. Um, so I'm going to give it a 8 out of 10. Like I said, it's really good. If you're a fan of hops, if you like really hoppy beers, um, I recommend you guys trying this one if you can find it. Price. Um, I believe these cost around like 11 bucks for the six pack. Um, I remember one of the stores I worked at, they were actually going for like 10 bucks for the six pack, which is like a crazy deal considering this is a 9.5% beer. And, uh, 
Also, I'd like to say the hops definitely covers up that boozy taste. You definitely couldn't tell this is 9.5%. Um, so you could drink a decent amount of these and uh, probably get you buzzed pretty fast. You probably drink three and uh, you might want to move on to something else. Because like I said, the ABV in this is pretty high. Definitely a good ABV for a double IPA. Um, but yeah, overall, if you guys like hoppy beers, you'll probably really like this one. It's uh, very drinkable for a 9.5% beer. As you guys can tell, I've just been slowly sipping it. Um, but yeah, there you have it. If there's any other liquor beers that you guys like to see on my channel, definitely leave a comment down below. And don't forget to like and subscribe for more upcoming videos on liquor and beer. Thanks for watching. Cheers.